Hey everybody, it's Gregor from the Friday Forge, and this week we're going to make a leather cuff. Or is it a bookmark? Or is it... Uh, you'll see. So, I really had intentions of making this leather cuff, which I suppose it still is. I don't know, you'll see at the end. I just kind of gave up on the idea. Oh, the things you can think. The stamp I'm using is a speckled matting stamp from Tandy. I get pretty lazy when it comes to dyeing, and, uh, well, a paper towel is all you need, really, in the end. I'm convinced that contact cement is the wonder of the world. But they really need to figure out that smell. It is absolutely putrid. I think I'm going to try one of those scentless contact cements that a lot of these leather companies are selling. Now I'll use my chisels to mark the sewing holes and I'll also sew first before I tidy up the edges.
For a simple project like this, all you need is 220 grit sandpaper. lot of satisfying things in this world and uh, quite frankly Edge Beveling is up there at the top, if not the top. Here I'm just using tap water and glycerin saddle soap to get ready for the edges for dyeing. We're in the home stretch now. I'd say in total, we've really only worked on this for about an hour. finish I just use token oil which is God's gift to the earth really and use my Dremel tools to burnish. That's it, we're all done. Uh, this actually works so well that it's sold within a few hours of posting on Etsy, so feel free to do it yourself. It's a short and simple project, cheap to make, and it's cheap to sell, so people buy it fast. That being said, if you want one, shoot me a DM, and I'm sure we'd be happy to make one for you. Thanks for watching.